I just found out that Meg actually can cook. So here I am in the kitchen with two talented chefs. No, I'm, I'm you know. Well, you can, you do you like? To. I have I have this much talent. Oh, <laughs> oh I thought she was going to show my ring and say this no, man no, is no. married. As much so as it's in you. his thank little you. Uh, yes, fingertip here. Look at look at that tiny little whisk. Isn't she sweet? Look at that cute, cute little cute. whisk. I like it. Yeah, we we're going to talk a little bit about. Um, Dressings, you know, hopefully okay. in the next few segments and new show, uh, few shows, I'm going to talk about dressings. How dressings are basically, in my opinion, they're like the glaze a great painter puts on their uh, uh, painting to oh. create tri uh, multi dimensional um, experience. The same thing for us with food. Okay. We create dressings to bring specific flavors to something that may not have its own flavor or we want to enhance its flavor. Yeah. This is all about citrus juices, so sugar is not needed. Who needs those full of sugar dressings when you can make something this simple at home? And what we got, Master Chef ready? Oh boy. Let's make the dressing <laughs> while you start cutting the vegetables, shall we? Uh, okay. What I want the you pepper? to do, there's a very sharp knife. Make sure that you hide your thumb behind your finger and start slicing those peppers for me in half moons, which are basically this shape. I, I'm a terrible that's it. slicer. <laughs> Keep the, that's it. Just pull uh, it back towards no. you. Oh, wait. Am I slicing okay. it upside down? Yeah. Yeah. Now turn it around. Turn it around. <laughs> turn it around. <laughs> now slice went. it. See how much easier it's going to be. Oh, yeah. Yeah, because you were fighting the skin there. Now you and I, we're going to put I some skin. lime juice. We're going to add some apple cider vinegar. We're going to add some lemon juice, and we're going to add some grapefruit juice. Oh, These wow. are all fresh squeezed, by the way, and a little bit of fresh squeezed orange juice, okay? This is going to be a sweet dressing. Oh, absolutely, mm. but the beauty of it, when it's sweet, is because it's coming out of a box, and about 60% of that is sugar, and water and concentrate that is even more sugar. That's why uh, squeeze, fresh squeeze is completely different. Right. I'm going to drizzle this and you whisk. Or okay. would you like me to do the, uh, the opposite? I'm a whisker. Whisk away, man. Let's go. All right. You I'm ready? a whisker. Now, I want you to use your, you're using your arm. Use your wrist. That's oh. it. That's it. Oh. A little bit faster. 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 I feel like I shouldn't she be here. She's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That's great. That's good. Oh, now, a little bit, a little bit of uh, uh, one of your <laughs> spoons, one of those little spoons. Everything she's got is little today. And taste this dressing a little bit for me. Okay. Are you nervous? I would be. He was uh, like right <laughs> in your face. You told oh, me something about the, the I, cauliflower. Cauliflower in intimidates face. me. Okay, I'll okay, show you. I don't why. even know because, how to cut it. Because what? we always try to cut and then take the stems, uh, the yeah, yeah. stems and right. the florets. If you take the stem as a guide, right there, okay, and you hold it and you start cutting around the stem. Just gonna cut that out. Yeah, cut the first few florets out. Oh, they just come right out like that then. Yeah. Because Emma really likes baked cauliflower. That's beautiful. Yeah, yeah, but That's we don't, beautiful. it's hard to cut. Yeah. So you now, get it? Okay. You, just, now this is sitting wise, upside down and you just go around and you cut the florets off. Huh, how about that? That's better than just taking it and from the top. And then the last piece right here, cut the whole thing off. There's your florette. This baby right here for Emma, especially, what we're gonna do is you're gonna peel this. Yeah, that's oh you can eat that. That's oh my eat god. That? Really? Are you kidding me? You're gonna love this. Hold on. What do I what do we Oh, ooh, oh, mm. On the spot. What is my salt? Oh, look it. Mmm. <laughs> Good? Oh, that's nice, really huh? Yeah, it's really oh, yeah. good. Yeah. Anyway, this is the beauty of this. What we're going to do when we come back, I'm going to take all of these vegetables, marinate them in that uh, dressing. That dressing is going to be absorbed due to the acidity and some of the help from this uh, sea salt. Then some fresh spinach as a canvas in the bottom of the plate. And for you, darling, if you can see her, the beauty, the lamb queen right there, she's sitting. Look, you look great. The lamb queen is going to get a little bit of shredded lamb over her salad. Mm. So Cassandra that's going to be the salad. The By cream. the way, for Rob, I made gluten-free rolls. You've had the rest. Now you're going to have the best. This is from Brazil, and this is a tapioca roll. So it has no gluten whatsoever or any other uh, refined flours in it whatsoever. By the way, what, how was your dressing? Very good. Oh, good. Well right. done. Let's keep finishing this because why? Right. We're going to need a little bit of salt Can I still here. Whiskey? Keep, keep whisking. Am Please. I going fast enough? <laughs> That conversation actually does remind me of college, which is funny because we're talking about college next. Friends, memories, regrets. What do you wish you did or didn't do in Listen college? Listen to my dad. What do That's say? what I wish. Oh, you he wish told me let's study and I didn't. Okay, we'll talk about that coming up.
Two. He can still be on.